everyone, we're going to find the value of x for log base x of 16 equals 2, uh, and another problem, log base 2 root 2 of 64 equals x. So um, to help us out, since we're not used to looking at the logs, let's we are used to looking at exponents, so I'm just going to use this conversion here and write this as uh, my base. We're doing this problem x, and this is your power, squared equals 16. Now, um, since uh, we have that, and our x, this has to be positive. Now, for log, the x has to be positive, because that's your domain for log uh, base of x. All right, so it always has to be positive. The graph looks like something like this. So uh, x always has to be positive there. So therefore, our x um, is going to be um, equal to 4. So you take the square root of both sides. You get x equals plus or minus 4. But you can't take the minus, so you have to just do x is uh, 4. All right, the next one, uh, same thing. Let's look at this. Let's rewrite it. So that's your base. So we're going to write 2 square root of 2. Your power is x equals 64. All right, so we want to get the same basis here so we can solve this. Um, 2 square root of 2 is the same as square root of 8. All right? And I'm going to write this as uh, 8 squared. All right, so the bases still aren't the same. So this is 8 to the power of 1 half of x, writing it in rational form, equals 8 squared. So when you multiply this using your uh, product rule for exponents, this is going to be 8 to the power of x divided by 2 equals 8 squared. Therefore, what's going to happen is you can um, simplify this. Uh, we have the same base, so we have x divided by 2 equals 2, because our x is in the exponents. You cross multiply, you're going to get x equals 4. And that's it. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm.